Yo B, they ready. Let's go. Feeling myself, I'm feeling myself, I'm feeling my, feeling myself, I'm feeling myself, I'm feeling my, feeling my, feeling myself, I'm feeling myself, I'm feeling my, feeling myself, I'm feeling myself, I'm feeling my. I'm with some hood girls looking back at it, and a good girl in my tax bracket got a black card and let sex have it. These Chanel bags is a bad habit. I, I do balls, tail Mavericks, my made back black. Hey my queens, it's your girl Aisha Renee. Um, this is my very, very first YouTube video, my very first vlog, and I'm so excited to finally get started. I've always wanted to record and you know, my videos, but I never had the confidence to do it, I would say. Well, today's the day. I am 20 weeks today. 20 weeks pregnant today and I just decided I wanted to start recording my pregnancy and talk about my symptoms and everything like that so actually today I wanted to do the old wives tale ginger thing I actually wrote down some right here on a piece of paper and I just picked out 10 that I thought would be fun to do and then at the end of the video I will let you know if it was correct or if it was wrong. I've actually seen quite a few of these on YouTube and a lot of them that I did watch were actually accurate. So I'm hoping that mine is accurate. We'll see. Okay, the first one I have is Sweet versus Salty. If it says if you're craving a lot of sweets like cakes, cupcakes, and fruits and things, you're having a girl. And if you're craving like sweet, salty stuff like chips and greasy burgers and stuff, you're having a boy. Well, I'm actually craving everything unhealthy <laughs> like salty chips, Doritos, um, burgers, every, you name it. Um, I actually tried to eat a cake, a piece of cake, a cupcake on my birthday. I threw it up. I, I got sick. I, I can't eat any of the sweets. So, one point for the boy. The next one, morning sickness. It says if you're having a lot of morning sickness, you're having a girl. And if you're not having any at all, you're having a boy. And my first couple of weeks of being pregnant, it was horrible. Like, I was throwing up constantly and feeling so sick so yeah one point for girl glow or not if you're glowing and people are telling you oh you're, you're so glowing your skin or your skin is glowing you're having a boy but if you're breaking out a lot your skin is really dry well not not dry but if you're breaking out a lot um you have you're having a girl i haven't had any breakouts this pregnancy none whatsoever like at all so one point for boy another point for the boy sorry spouse weight gain it says if your spouse is gaining weight right along with you then it's a girl and if he's not putting on weight at all it's a boy my husband he hasn't gained any weight but he's also on this weight loss and get in shape thing <laughs> so yeah, but be, I mean, no, he hasn't gained any weight. So that's another point for the boy. Moody or mellow? Oh, um, I say I'm fine. <laughs> but my husband, um, I don't know. I asked him, what do you think if I'm real moody or whatever? He was just like, I'm normal. But normal, I'm moody. So <laughs> one minute I can be cool and next minute I can be, get out my face. I don't want to be bothered. So, I mean, I'm normal, so I guess that's another point for the boy because I'm not really super moody or emotional. Or eye test. I haven't seen anyone do this eye test. It's pretty much, you know, if you stare in a mirror and your eyes dilate, it's a boy. And if it don't dilate, it's a girl. Well... I mean, I did it. Mine's dilated, but when I'm not pregnant, it does that. So that's why I was confused on that one. Like, even when I'm not pregnant, my eyes do that. So I'm just going to give that to no one. Carrying high or low? Um, I think I'm carrying low. <sighs> my husband thinks I'm carrying low. My mother, 
a lot of people say I'm carrying low, but then I have some people say I'm carrying high. So, um, I don't know. I could never tell if I'm low or high. I would say... This is weird. I would say I'm more low and then high. My other girls were way up here, like in my ribs, like oh, my two girls. So I don't know. This look low to me. It looks slow to me. But if you guys think that it's high, then let me know. But I, I'll give that point to the boy as well. Heart rate. They say if the baby's heart weight is above 140, it's a girl. And if it's below 140, it's a boy. We actually went to our ultrasound this Monday. Today is third. Today is Wednesday. We went Monday and the heart weight was 136. So that's a boy. Chinese gender test. Um, you take the month which you re you conceived, and then you take the age you were in that month. I conceived in October um, and I was 26 at the time so that was a boy so another point for the boy okay number 10 this is actually the ring test you take your wedding ring or any ring and you tie it over a string and you hold it above your stomach if it swings in a circle it was weird because I seen videos when it was the like opposite. Like I seen some videos when it says if it swings in a circle, it's a boy, and I seen other videos if it swings in a circle, it's a girl. Well, I the first thing I found on Google was if it swings in a circle, it's a girl, and if it swings side to side, it's a boy. So I'm gonna just go with that one because I was confused on that one. All right, so I'm gonna take my wedding ring. And I'm going to, in, in a string, and I'm going to hold it above my stomach and see if it swings in a circle or side to side. Let's go. That's a circle, and that's a big circle. <laughs> so that's a point for the girl okay well that was 10 um old wives tales that i did I'm gonna have to tell you guys if it was correct or not okay so according to the old wives tale i am having a boy seven for boy two for girl and one undecided so we are actually Having a girl. See, yep, girl. It's a little blurry. It's only 20 weeks. That's the best they could find, but it's a girl. So, the old wives' tale were completely wrong. I am a little heartbroken. I already have two little girls, and I wanted a boy. My own little boy. I have three stepsons which I love dearly but I wanted a little boy from birth and you know but I just you know I'm praying for a healthy baby either way it goes so my husband he was a little he was a little sad because he wanted me to experience my own boy of mine yeah that is it you guys this comment below let me know what you guys think like i said this is my very first youtube video um i would love to do more videos hopefully you can get to know me and my family a little better well thanks for watching stay tuned